your friend. Right? Try and sting me. And while you fail to penetrate my titanium shell, I will capture you! Richard, I have secured the specimens. Although I must inform you, I am unhappy with this assignment. Becoming a glorified fly swatter is not what I agreed to in our truce. Huh? <laughs> uh. And I definitely do not feel like an equal partner. <laughs> you don't look like one either. Even after installing my new humor program, I fail to understand what is so amusing. <laughs> you need to work on your comedic response circuits. Ha, ha, ha. How I loathe insects. Since you appear to have obtained a suitable supply of those filthy bloodsuckers, you may return to base. And once I've completed my experiment with those African mosquitoes, I'll have no use for her or her partnership. <sighs> for a moment, I thought I'd left the microphone on. Happy birthday! Feliz cumpleaños! No, Kong! Stop! I baked that cake for Francisca. Right. It's Ponchi's birthday, not yours. <laughs> oh, yuck! Kong, but this is my special day. And you all need to sing to me before we have the cake. Jonesy, I may specialize in veterinary medicine, but I also graduated medical school top of my class, and I know a bad case of laryngitis when I see it. That's right, no talking, and especially no singing. <laughs> I guess she heard him sing. <laughs> What's wrong, bro? Hey, Danny, do you understand why Kong's pouting? What's up, big guy? <laughs> Kong says he wants his own birthday, and his own birthday cake, and party! <laughs> well, we have no idea when Kong's birthday is, or even where he was born, for that matter. <laughs> then, for all we know, today could be his birthday! <laughs> Birthday error. <laughs> Kong says he wants every day to be his birthday with cake. <laughs> Sorry, bro. That's not how it works. <laughs> but now that I see how much it means to you, I promise that Amy and I will do everything we can to find out where you're from. Okay? <laughs> Why father ever wanted to look at the hideous ape is beyond even my advanced intellect. Good riddance. Much better. While my father did appreciate my genius, I think he also felt threatened, knowing how completely I'd overshadow him. Are we here to discuss your unresolved daddy issues? Or to gather your father's research? Very funny, Bottila. Yes, I can see that now. <laughs> All right, here we go. Dr. Leo Remy's research on how to feed the hungry. Delete. Move the poor. Delete. Oh, Father, where's the profit in that? Ah, here we are. Save animals in the wild from diseases. Father's plan was to use robotically engineered African mosquitoes to deliver the inoculation package. I will take it to the next level with my bionobotic enhancements, creating the Robosquito. Quite ingenious. Dad's concept was a complete waste of time and money. However, 
with minor modifications. My Roboskeetles will inject their victims with a mind control microchip coded with a message at a genetic level. A very simple message that even you dimwits will understand. Destroy calm. <sighs> Nasty little parasite. Even enhanced by science, it disgusts me. Who should we try this on first? I'm reasonably certain there will be little to no painful side effects. Wheeler, get back here! All right, Bragg, that just leaves. Oh, for the love of... Keep it away! Keep it away! Must destroy Kong. That's promising. Must destroy Kong. Must destroy <laughs> He may actually hate Kong as much as I do. And once Lucas and his friends are inoculated, they'll hate the ape too, and destroy him for me. An excellent plan. Except, how are they going to infect them if you don't know where they are? Oh, I already have a plan to flush out my do-gooder brother and his Kong crew. So, I assume you have the antidote ready in case you get bitten? I, uh, well, not yet. I, I... Ah! Get away from me, you nasty little bloodsucker! Botzilla, do something! <laughs> I don't have to be an animal whisperer to guess what you're thinking, bro. <laughs> you want to know your story? <laughs> you know you're like a brother to me. <laughs> but you want to know your real family too, right? <laughs> Amy and I are going to help you learn your history. Whatever it takes, buddy. Trust me. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Looks like Commissioner Decker's chopper. Nice to see Decker chasing actual bad guys instead of us for a change. <laughs> Decker's going down fast! <laughs> Strap onto your jetpack, Kong. We gotta try and save him. Jonesy, take the chopper and meet us under the bridge. Ow! Right behind you, Lucas! Hurry, bro! Go, Kong! Go! Small word, two syllables, sounds like? <laughs> I'm just playing with you, Jonesy. I see Kong, too. He's got him! Oh, fantastic! Now the Commissioner will have to clear Kong's name! Glad to see you're okay, Commissioner. Ready to thank Kong for saving your life? Must destroy Kong! What on earth? No! Yeah. Just got bananas! Everyone, back to the chopper! Must destroy Kong! Must destroy Kong! Oh no! Decker must have called in reinforcements! We've got Lucas Kong! Protect yourself! What's wrong with Lucas? I don't know. He just went nuts. Strap him in. We gotta get out of here. <laughs> Kong! Man, he's like an animal. He is. Did you see that cloud of... What were they, bugs? Something really weird is going on. 
I buckled him in. Let's go, Jonesy. We're bailing, buddy. Activate your camo and head for home. We'll meet you once we ditch them. <laughs> Once again, Decker failed to destroy Kong. Decker played his part. My brother is completely consumed by the full force of hatred. <laughs> hatred is a blunt instrument. Give me a good laser any day. Lucas will do everything in his power to destroy the big ape. <sighs> Nobody knows his weaknesses better than my brother. <laughs> and if the others are bitten, even better. This is usually where you do your gloating villain laugh. Let's see if my new laughter program can emulate it. <laughs> you ruin everything. Did you hear that? Must destroy. Finally, he's all worn out. What's that? Oh, one of those things is inside. Don't let it bite you. Where is it now? There! Behind you, Danny! <laughs> Missed! Punchy, do you see it? I don't have to see it. I can hear it. Are you a ninja? That was incredible! Mm, I grew up playing in a jungle. It's the survival of the fastest. Ninja. <laughs> Must. Destroy Kong! <laughs> Poor Kong has no idea why his bro suddenly hates him. Oh, don't worry, sweet Kong. Amy will figure it out. Ooh. You were right to bring us here, Amy. Look, only Richard would have trashed this. I remember their dad, Dr. Remy, telling me about an idea he had for inoculating animals in the wild. I'm pretty sure that's where Richard stole the tech for this. Leave it to Richard to twist science that was created to save nature into a weapon of mass hatred and destruction. <laughs> Must destroy. So, we'll just have to untwist it. I hope. We know that whatever the Robosquito injected into Lucas is affecting his brain on, on a genetic level. Yes, that's it. Clearly, it's stimulating his rage centers. If we don't reverse this, it may cause permanent damage. Got it! Genetic markers indicate this is an especially aggressive mosquito indigenous to East Africa that's only found in the Virunga Mountains. I know. As in volcanoes. Active or not, we need to acquire living specimens if I'm to create an antidote. How quickly can you get us to Africa, Jonesy? Uh, sis, isn't it like seriously dangerous to have Lucas along on this mission? Of course, Danny, but we need to get that antidote into him as soon as possible. Kong! Must destroy Kong! He sure stays on point. So what's the plan, sis? Once I have an antidote to cure Lucas, we'll reactivate the Robosquito Pinchy took down and use it to inject Decker and any others Richard infected along the way. How's the Skeeto gonna find the zombies? Well, these mosquitoes leave a special scent when they bite. I can program the Robosquito to hone in on those pheromones to locate the victims and deliver the antidote. Must destroy Kong! Lucas, no! Jonesy, look out! Destroy Kong! Must destroy Kong! Jonesy! Just stunned. Let's 
to make sure his seatbelt's locked before he wakes up. Amy, are you sure it's a good idea leaving Lucas alone? No, but we can't risk having him get loose in the jungle. It's safer for everybody keeping him tied up in the copter. <laughs> Must destroy Kong. Must destroy Kong! He's getting worse. The clock is ticking. Let's head out. Oh, that's a lot of jungle to search for a little bug. I take it back. Finding bugs isn't the problem. The problem is finding the right one. I just swallowed a bug. Oh, I hope that wasn't the one we needed. The secret is keeping your mouth shut, right, Jonesy? <laughs> Jonesy's bugging out! <coughs> Jonesy, dance, funk! <laughs> Danny, Jonesy's not dancing. He got too close to a termite mound. <laughs> but he's still got some nice moves. Termites may seem like pests to us, but they're like candy to the troops of gorillas that used to live here. <laughs> gorillas lived here? Oh, yes. Before poachers drove them to extinction, there were countless troops in this very jungle. <laughs> I found something! Those are Botilla's footprints. Mm, those heels are so yesterday. Oh, snap! We better keep our eyes open for... Ah, more footprints, as well as roots in muddy holes and stuff. That footprint means we're close. Let's keep moving. And let's all be careful. And by all, I mean klutzy me. You're lucky that the worst thing that's happened so far is you tripping on a root. Yeah, guess there isn't much left in this jungle that can hurt you. <laughs> Got a bite, Josie? Ugh, because I just did. I think we found the mosquito. Oh, too much of a good thing. We need live, healthy samples. <laughs> they seem healthy enough. They're being very well fed. No lie. Kong, these things are eating us alive. How about blowing them away? <sighs> good job, Kong. These are more than enough samples for an antidote. Yeah. <sighs> Got an antidote for itching, Amy? Cross your fingers. If this doesn't cure him, I'm afraid that nothing will. No! No! Destroy! Oh, was I asleep? Uh, I had a nightmare. This looks like Africa? I can remember fragments, like some kind of fever dream. Poor Kong. I'm sure he didn't understand. I've got to apologize to him. So, where is Kong? I haven't seen him since we went inside the copter to give you the cure. Oh, man. He must have run away because of the way I treated him. I've got to explain things to him. Kong! Kong! Lucas, wait! We have to get home with the antidote. Dakar and his men are still infected, and who knows how much time they have left before it becomes irreversible. Besides... Kong is too sweet and forgiving to hold a grudge, even if he didn't understand your behavior. I got a feeling from Kong that he wanted to go looking for his family. Whatever it is, I have to find him. How about this? Jonesy and I will go back to San Francisco with the antidote, and you three stay here to look for Kong. That sounds great. And Amy? Thanks. Hey, Jonesy, did you have a chance to finish making the comm unit for Kong? Too bad we didn't get it on him before he disappeared. But it'll be the first thing I do when we find Kong. Good luck, and stay safe! Well, it could be anywhere. Where do we start? Hey, we found itsy-bitsy mosquitoes in that great big jungle. How hard can it be to find a giganda gorilla? Uh, missed! 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 Not. Go away! Leave me alone! You have hyper-fast reflexes and a laser-guided optical tracking system. Protect me! Your bug, your problem, partner. Ah! It bit me! It bit me! Do something! 
I don't want to turn into a zombie. I, I, I don't feel any different at all. Must be because you already want to destroy Kong. You were bitten by that hate bug years ago. Hmm. I believe I just made a joke. Hilarious. <laughs> Oops. I laughed my head off. Lucas, what if we find Kong and he doesn't want to come home with us? Uh, what's happening? Sounds like the volcano is getting more active. We need to find Kong fast. 